long time ago. Uh, when they camped, there was a big camp at Kokanin, at Piri Heads, and he was there, Indic. Every night, or oh, he would go up the sky and t walk, travel round. It wasn't just round Australia. He would walk round the world. Whatever he was doing, it took him all night. And in the daytime, or in yeah, then he would come down, back to the camp. That was Indic, the moon. We may hand the star also was camped on the beach, and would would happily see him come down safe every morning, whatever, back down to earth. This time, she decided if she went to the to visit him again and and you know had a talk round the fire to his ganya, where he said, Indic said to him again, "No more now, no more. I'm th I'm thinking about going up and not coming back down to the earth." And she said, why, what's that? He said, no, I want to live up there now. I want to stay up. Coming back and forth, uh, you get tired. You, I think I like it up in the sky. So he did. But when he said that, she said, oh, don't leave me. No, leave me. But I always then break, break that English and then tell everybody in the line of my mother's language, don't leave me. So when he went up, went up, the, the moon went up, Indic went up, he left the camp and went up. He went up, went up, went up, went went after him and went up the sky. The crowd and the tribes along the, along the beach, along Kokanin, Pira Heads, saw what happened because when Wimigen followed Indic and went up to the sky, it was always for Aboriginal uh, culture, like, if not in story, but in the sense that, well, it's happened, and then, of course, the moon came up in the sky, beside him was the star, women, an Indic. And today, you still see them together. The evening star beside the moon. That's that story. She went after him when she said, Yuganindrai, Yuganindrai, Yuganindrai. Don't leave me, don't leave me. And there they are still together. The star and moon is always there to guide them. And I think like a lot of other things remind us how much, yeah, how much this beautiful world is of the bright moon and star. And who were they? They were lovers. Mm -hmm.